Hi, we're back again. Thanks for watching my YouTube. I love to have you back. And today I want to speak to you about disruption and the lives we're living now that are just filled with disruption. We are in a disruptive period so that we can make great changes going forward into the 20s. So be, you know, be aware you're going to fasten your seatbelt because the 20s are going to be uh, tumultuous. That's the right word, the tumultuous 20s. So I want you to understand some of the deeper meaning for all this. We are crossing out. Remember, I always say we're tied to the heavens and we have big, huge transit that are plowing us through whether we like it or not. So the country and the world is in disruption. You see a lot of um, riots going on, whether it's Hong Kong or in Iraq or, uh, you know, just name any part of the globe. There's some kind of protests going on and there's some type of disruption. And here in the United States, we are literally going to be disrupting the federal government. And so we actually have the chief disruptor of our president right now. So he's really in here as goes along. He's basically a symbol of the things that we are going through, which is disruption. And this is all part of the changes that have come out of another age of the industrial age, moving us forward into the technological age. So we have to get used to it. And so you'll find a lot of disruption has resulted in a um, building of what cities and, and around the country, there are the hubs of education and business and they keep growing so that a lot of areas of the country do not have this quality. And so they're kind of withering and dying from the old industrial age. So the key is to know knowledge and have specialized knowledge boutique knowledge. It's not enough to just be able to work long days and work hard. You have to have knowledge. So until the other parts of the nation gather up and are sort of pulled along into these vortexes that all these cities and they're in each state, but there are certain pockets in the country where they're even stronger. We're always going to have a sort of like a have and a have not society. And where you have a have not and a have society, you're going to have to have a lot of disruption. And this will only feed into the heavenly transits that's coming in 2024. So the 20s are all about understanding the disruption, putting together a new system, and literally breaking apart different industries of the nation. And that will be all what I call it. I just wrote a, a blog uh, yesterday on the um, endangered species of the middleman or the middle woman which is the brokers, the agents. These are the endangered species because as we move forward into this technological age, we are making these master changes. You've seen it in the banks. I went into Chase the other day and there were absolutely no tellers. It was just private banking and a lot of ATM machines. That was it. And if you go into other industries, you will find that people are missing. You hear the checkout, self-checkout into Target or your grocery store, self-checkout. Again, more technological, less people. And so, again, it's taking you into more disruption. Some of the vulnerable areas of work you will see will be um, agents that are real estate agents. These are, these are going to be the dying breeds because that whole disruption is taking place now in the real estate business. And you're going to see people selling their own houses more, working on the internet more, doing it themselves. The Uber, the Lyft, the Airbnb, the Amazons of the world. You're going to see it come into the health industry. You're going to see agents, brokers being finishing. Their, their jobs are taken away. You already have stockbrokers. That's over with is the old system. They have free trading now with TD Ameritrade and Charles Schwab zero cost to trade yourself. Okay. That doesn't mean that you don't pay other ways, but it's this disruption. It's in every, every industry. So what do you need to do? You need to have boutique knowledge. You need to go back to school, train yourself. Okay. Disruption is part of our lives now. Now, as we go into the twenties and we go through the next, we go through say 2020 and 2024, things will be what I'll say, uh, more people oriented, having to try to fix some of these problems of this changeover from the industrial to the technological. So fix some of these issues in parts of the country that are withering and dying. Uh, the towns in, in the south or the towns in, 
in other parts of the Midwest, the Rust Belt, that they're going to have to come back. But that's not going to happen until you get into the 20s and you get further past 2024. So you can expect that by the time we get through the 20s, you will have changes to the amendment. You will have a very different system uh, starting. It was still going on changes in the way that the federal system of running the government. Guess who is the ultimate agent and broker? Is your politician at the federal level. So congressional situation is going to change. So I don't know whether we're going to have direct democracy down the road, but it's something like it, or we'll be going that direction. Now that is the tumultuous time because the people in power do not want to give it up. They do not want to do it. But right now and going forward, the federal government is too cumbersome and big, and it can't address the needs of the states and the cities quick enough. And most of those needs are going to be handled by the states and the cities. So the federal government is a, is a, it's not that it will completely go away, it'll change. It will morph into something that is more practical for the time. So this is disruption. And you can expect it for the next 10 years for sure. So you need to govern yourself accordingly. Get your niche market. There are certain areas that are going to be completely protected. N niche boutique your knowledge, okay? Don't be a broker or an agent and look at those areas and see where you're going to be replaced. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you the next time. Thank you again for watching. If you enjoy my videos, I'd love to have you like it or subscribe that would be great and if you need more information i do have a book called divine design how you created the life you're living which will explain some of the information i have talked about on my youtube channel and there also is the opportunity for you to have a private session with me with the link below you can go to my website that's all there always thank you i know your time is valuable i appreciate your sharing it with me